In my last video, I took a look at the BC250 board, which is an ex-mining board comprising of cut-down PS5 chips that didn't make the grade for PS5s. Um, unfortunately, I had an issue with the sound um, and the audio was really stuttery when I was recording my game footage. I've now added this USB sound uh, DAC, which has solved this problem, and it seems to have sorted out the emulators, which are now running at the right speed for the ROM that they're using. So 60 frames a second for NTSC ROMs and 50 frames a second for PAL ROMs. Anyway, let's take a look at the footage and hopefully the sound will be good this time.
Make a list. 
Just me. Yes. Oh. 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 Don't be mad. Make a ride. Just me. As you can see the addition of a USB audio DAC has made all the difference and this BC250 is now running smooth as anything. All the emulators are running at the correct frame rates for the ROM that they're running 
Um, it just seemed a lot smoother and a lot snappier too for some strange reason. I guess there was some sort of lag being caused by the audio delay. I think that was what was happening um, with it. It's a shame that I couldn't get it to work just out of the box. I tried different DisplayPort cables, different DisplayPort adapters. My DisplayPort to HDMI is pretty good. Um, so it should have worked. If you have an idea what could be causing the problem, drop a comment down below. And if you enjoyed that video, please give it a like. If you could subscribe to the channel, that would be great. And I'll see you again in the next one. Thanks very much for watching.